And yoga is about balance, harmony, integration. It's about bringing reconciliation where previously there was fragmentation. Now, because I teach this, sometimes people think, wow, he must be so chilled. He must be so zen. He must have his stuff together. All assumptions which people who know me well would tell you are laughable at best because I am a wounded human being. And I teach yoga <laughs> because yoga was the healing modality that my wounded being was most drawn to. So all my life, I have always loved movement and embodiment. I, I love having a body. I love running in the mountains, swimming in the ocean. I love playing sports and I still would if my body could cope with it. <laughs> and I've always loved singing and I've always loved language and literature and story and mythology. So in the territory of my yoga teaching, these are the heartlands. Movement, singing, inquiry, story, mythology. These are the modalities that I've constantly been exploring for more than 30 years. These are the lenses that I've been looking at life through every day for more than 30 years. And so this is what I share. This is what I teach. But I teach as a student, as an apprentice. And as I keep exploring through these modalities, they help show me where I'm still getting in my own way. They help show me where I'm my own enemy. And they give me, yoga gives me practical principles to help get out of my own way and help me heal those schisms inside myself that if I don't address them will perpetuate this fragmentation and this disintegration. So I love yoga because it helps me every day heal myself a little bit more.